welcome back to my channel. I'm filming a apartment tour today. I feel like I've literally put it off for so long. We've been in this apartment like almost three months now. Um, but if you've moved out, you know how long it takes just to get everything sorted and get all like the cute decor bits. Um, so yeah, it's not 100% finished and I still want to get like loads more little cute decor bits. But I thought I can't keep putting it off and I'm always like, oh, we'll film it when I've tidied and I film it when like I've got this and that but I just thought fuck it let's just upload it and film it now hope that you guys enjoy the video and if you've got any questions on where anything's from or moving process or anything like that please leave me a comment down below and I'll get back to you I'm gonna start from when you first come in so you first walk in to the hallway and then we've got the bathroom on the right hand side I love this bathroom so much. I feel like it's literally like my bathroom of dreams. So it's just got obviously the toilet, the bath. Um, I've got a little bath tray on there as well. It's all this like really nice dark gray sort of tiled color. We got this under the sink storage cabinet just because it honestly fits so much in. If you know me, you know I literally have like 101 products that I do not need um so this literally fits loads and when I first moved I was a bit worried um but yeah we literally just brought this off of Amazon I think it's about like 30 or 40 pound but it's so worth it um and then I've just got some little flannels rolled up here I feel like it gives me spa vibes that I have them there and then I always hide this little air freshener just behind them so you can't really see it too much. Then we've got our um, hand soap and toothbrush holder. These are both from B&M. It's like this really pretty beige sort of stony colour. They look really expensive and I honestly think they were like £4 each or something and £5. Then just behind this mirror, we've got some more products shock. It's not as nice as when I first moved in. I had it all really organised but yeah we've just got too much stuff to be honest i then i've got this little glass trinket tray um and i've got all my elemis uh not elemis sorry a spa products on there this candle smells so nice isn't well it's like the winter one it was all all these products were from the spa advent calendar they brought out and it was so good i then got some more storage this little basket is from Danelle, and it honestly fits so many products and like all of these are full size and i think it's just so nice it's like the sort of like knitted like chunky knit material another one of probably one of the best purchases that we've brought um when we moved out was these shelves from amazon again they just hold so many products and they're really sturdy and they're just like the sticky back like stick on shelf so you haven't got to drill anything in or anything which is so good because obviously we're renting so I don't want to like mark the walls or tiles or anything and then just the bath mat and the hand rail but yeah I just love it this is the kitchen area so we've got like a join living and kitchen room sort of like open plan space but I just absolutely love the kitchen when I first seen the navy blue I wasn't 100% sure on it but I think like with the wood it just goes so nicely and with the marble as well so we've obviously you've got just like all the fridge and everything and our storage cupboards um and then we've got all of our kettle and toaster and microwave matching from Danelm I really like it because it's like it reminds me of like old-fashioned you know when like the whatever you call it temperature timer thing goes up i just really love that and then the toaster has got the same um i think having like wood into your home just makes it feel so much more cozy i don't know what it is um and then we've got this serving board here as well i just think it like brings all of the wood and like the breakfast bar section together I've then put together a little like candle slash re diffuser section. So on this tray, I saw this from my sister, but I'm actually not sure where it's from. Um, the donut vase is from H&M Home, which I absolutely love. It was a little bit more expensive. I think it was around like £30, but I just think it's so worth it. It's really good quality. And then I got my bunny towels from 
Asta Home. It's so hard to remember where I got everything from because I feel like I brought it so long ago now. Um, and then this candle as well. I'm obsessed with this sort of print at the minute. I've got it on my lamps in my bedroom as well. I'll show you them in a second. Um, yeah, I just love it. I think when you have little bits like this, it just makes it feel so much more cosy. And then the breakfast bar stools. So half of our apartment was actually furnished before we moved in. So these came with it. So I'm not really sure where they're from either. And then we've just got the TV on this white cabinet. Again, this part came furnished, but I'm sure you can get us from Ikea or somewhere. I've also put in some, because when we first moved in, I felt like it wasn't that cosy. I got this lantern from TK Maxx and then I also got these LED candles. We've then got the lounge just as you come out of the hallway. This is our sofa. It's literally so good if you've got um, a small space because this bit lifts up so you can put all like bedding or just any extra storage under there and then this bit of the sofa actually pulls out so it makes a double bed and it's actually so big for a sofa bed um this throw is from b&m and then i think these cushions are from denelm i got them a while ago um but the middle ones are from b&m and i think they're so nice and make it really cozy this table I absolutely love. It came furnished with the apartment though, so I have no clue where it's from. Um, same as the TV stand. I do need to get some more like candles and wax melt burners for the apartment because um, I feel like you can just never have enough. We've then got the second bedroom. Um, so I've turned into sort of like a wardrobe slash getting ready room. Um, I've first of all got my makeup desk. I've just got the IKEA. Ignore me in this mirror, by the way. I've just got the um, IKEA makeup desk. I can't remember what one this is called. Um, it's really messy in here. It was tidy in here before, I promise. Um, but yeah, I just think it looks a lot more like. Obviously, there's not as much storage as the Alex drawers, which I had in my old bedroom. But I just think it looks a lot more like sleek and nice and. It makes me not have as much stuff and hoard because I choose to have all them drawers just full of stuff that I don't need. This green chair actually came furnished with the apartment. It was originally in the lounge, but I think it just looks so much nicer in here, especially because we've got beige sofa now. The green didn't really go too well. Um, and then my mirror is from Denelm. I've not actually got it like secure to the wall i just rest on there so i hope that's fine this is the print that i said i was obsessed with earlier they're from um home sense i got them a couple of weeks ago but i just think they're so nice i think they're actually supposed to be like glasses or something but i use them as makeup brush holders and then i got this little gold mirror i think this is from denam as well i got it in lockdown so not sure if they still sell it but i just think it's really cute i love the gold i then just put a white throw over the side of the chair to make it feel a bit more cozy this sofa actually came furnished with the apartment but it just wasn't very comfy it wasn't very like homely so we just moved it in here and then got a new sofa um we don't really use it to be honest we just use it to like put stuff on like washing and but i think i do need to get some like maybe some like cream pillows similar to the one in the um lounge just because i think like it just looks so bare i've just got a hot water bottle and a black blanket on it for the minute but yeah it's just it's not really my vibe in the corner for some extra storage slash sort of display i've got a clothes rail we only just put like a few bits of clothing on here like i've just got some of my blazers liam's got some of his like favorite tops on there um but yeah i think it just looks so nice and if you've got a small apartment like me and not much storage i think it just makes it like so much um like better for storage because you obviously don't need as much space in the wardrobes um i've tried to like make storage like as many places as possible um because obviously we don't have much only in like a two bedroom apartment then down here i've just got some of my bags um again with like storage you just need to find like random places like in this flannels bag got i don't know what's in there just stuff that i don't really need all the time but it just like makes it look like a nice display sort of little bag um so yeah i've just got some more bits in there but this clothes route is from denelm as well we got so many things from denelm and these hangers i can't remember where these were from to be honest i think they're from primark home um but yeah i think they're like rose gold just makes it look so nice 
also got a, another cupboard here. Ignore how messy this is, please. It's like kind of half of Liam's wardrobe, half just random shoes and clothes that like we really need to sort it out. The only annoying thing is when we moved in, I asked if we could like put up um like a rail to go all across because the cupboard is actually quite big like you could have lots of storage in here but they said they wouldn't put one up um i mean do we just risk it and put one up ourselves i'm not really sure i'm a bit worried but yeah this clothes are actually holds so much things and then uh, we've got more storage in our bedroom as well and then moving on to our bedroom so we've got the bed first of all there's still so many like little decor things that I want to get for the bedroom but I thought like I can't keep putting off the apartment tour till I'm 100% happy with it because I feel like you will never fully like feel like you have everything there's always more stuff you can buy um but I love our bed and it gives me very like hotel vibes it's got all of this it's like waffle with this like black piping around the outside this is from B&M and then this white throw is just from Primark Home uh, they came with the side cabinets and the bed frame um so obviously like i would want some more beige but we can get over that you can actually get like um headboard covers i think so i might have a look into those but i'm happy with it for the minute for our side lamps it's again this um really nice like glass print that i'm obsessed with it's got little like a gold um stand bit on the bottom and it just makes the walls look really pretty it always like obviously it's daytime at the minute so you can't see it as well but it all like reflects on the walls um and these are from home bargains i only got them last weekend so i'm sure they'll st still be there but i think they were like eight pound or something so they was not expensive at all and it's a battery operated one so it's not you don't have like any like annoying wires there or anything um but yeah i love these then just got this ikea mirror because our um bedroom is like on a corner it's got this really annoying wall thing in the middle but i don't mind it to be honest like it's quite nice to have the mirror leaned against um just to cover this wall a little bit we've then got this storage cabinet from ikea liam built this one which i'm so glad that i did not have to do because i hate building ikea stuff um and then i've just got a little reed diffuser these cute little tea light holders from primark home i think they were literally like one pound each um and then this moon lamp is from oliver bonus I need to get something to go in here. I'm thinking probably Pampas. I might have a look today because I'm going to B&M to see if I can fit anything in here. But I've just got my little incense stick holder and some of my crystals in here for now. I usually use this when I have flowers and stuff. So yeah, but I think because the majority of the time I don't have flowers, it would be nice to just put something in here. We've then just got our little storage basket for our dressing gowns just to make it look a little more tidy. And then this basket has got my heated blanket in. I do want to do something a bit cuter with this area, but this is how it's like for now. And I just got this um, washing basket. I found it really hard to find a washing basket that I actually liked, I'm not going to lie. This is from Denelm. It's just like a plastic one. And then my wardrobe that matches the... Um, bedside drawers but yeah that is the bedroom that is the end of today's video i hope you guys have enjoyed and it gives you some inspo if you've recently moved out or looking to move out um but if anyone's got anything that they think will look really cute in my home let me know because i just love home decor i feel like i never just have enough of it um so yeah let me know thanks so much for watching and i'll speak to you in the next video